Hey guys, it's me. I'm not gonna say Karen again because it's getting boring. How are you guys doing? Uh, I'm feeling a little better since the last video, <laughs> even if nobody saw it. Uh, well, anyways. And I'm actually, I look kind of weird, but <laughs> because I'm wearing one of those dresses that I showed in my, not last video, but the video before. And when I bought it, I thought it's not going to fit me because I'm plus size, obviously. But I bought it anyways because I know I'm going to lose weight because I just am. And then I thought, eh, I just tr decided to try it on and it fits. But except for you can't do like this. Do you know how, that's how you can tell that a shirt doesn't fit you or a dress. If you can't do this and it, it like is very tight then you should buy a bigger size, just in case you didn't know that. <laughs> just a little tip. But this dress is so cute. I think it's so cute, but you can't really tell. But I don't have, <laughs> well, I can't be an acrobat, but you can see I'm wearing my, I'm wearing very cute shoes <laughs> and cute leggings too. <laughs> and I'm sitting on the floor as usual. Which I hate because my back, like I told you. No, like, I think I've told you guys in previous videos that I'm a shopaholic. I need to shop and it drives my dad crazy. No. It doesn't matter if it's like, if I go to a store, you know, just buy cigarettes or something. Just one, like, magazine or something. I just, you know, I don't know what it is. It's like strange it's like i have to buy it you know but that's something i have to work with excuse me i'm massaging my legs because i have something wrong with my um uh left foot which i don't know what's wrong with it because the stupid doctors don't send me to them they send me to some um uh, what's it called in english uh well somebody who's not a doctor <laughs> But I want to see a doctor because I was thinking, I've been Googling it. Why are they doing it? Oh, it's because I am. It's too small. Well, anyways, uh, it's because, I think it's because, what was I saying? <laughs> no, I, because I told them I was overweight. And then they thought, oh, okay, we'll send her to some other place, you know. They didn't care. But, like... Please, if it hurts this fucking much. I took, last night, for example, I took two headache pills. And usually they work, but they didn't, you know? So, you see how I'm slouching? <gasps> now I look like, <laughs> I don't know. No, but it was, it's stupid, you know, Sweden. Oh, I don't know if y'all knew I lived in Sweden. I'm not like you're going to find me or anything. <laughs> you don't give a fuck where I live anyway, so. No, I was going to show you some stuff. Because I'm a shopaholic and I like showing off stuff. But actually, I don't know where I bought some of this stuff. Well, I do, but it, where you live, it, it might not be available, of course. How strange, this little... Like a little circle, a white circle just entered the thing. I don't know. You know, I suck at all this shit. Oh, I shouldn't. <laughs> I don't even have, I have a tripod, but I haven't assembled it yet. So you're sitting on a chair from the 70s. Think about it. I was like seven years old. And my dear sweet mom was vacuuming the floor. And I fell asleep in this chair. So this chair has so much meaning to it because you could hear it like the nice sound of the vacuum cleaner and you know you you knew you were safe with mom. <laughs> okay, now time to break. Like I said, Ram Lessa. Okay, but I don't know what the shit. I have so much stuff so I don't remember what I've shown. We can begin with the, uh, um, 
not last time, but uh, the time before I went to the city. Well, city, city. No, it's not like we big in, live in a big city. <clears throat> My uh, backpack, uh, the chain wouldn't work. So I had to go in and buy a new one, but I bought three. <laughs> And I'm going to show you two of them because the other one's in the, the one that I'm using is in there. And I don't want to let you in there just yet. Maybe later. This one I love, but see, with me, you know, when I first buy it, like a uh, backpack, I think it's, oh, so beautiful and everything. You can't, you have to be careful and stuff. I don't know how people do with, you know, rich people do. How can they keep, like, a Louis Vuitton clean and safe and stuff like that? Because I think so, but then I throw it around like this. So I don't know what they think. Well, they're rich, of course, so they can buy another one. But I think it's sad because I want to keep them as pretty, but I just don't for some reason. But this one is so cool. It reminds me of, uh, what's it called in English? Uh, Norwegian, uh, Northern Lights, uh, but that's, I don't know if it's called, but, North, well, it's, it's pretty anyways, and it was pretty cheap too, and then I bought this one too, this one I like, also, <laughs> yeah, this is Vans, but this one I don't know. But these are, if you live in Sweden, these are probably still available, I think. Because I, these I bought recently, actually. I think I have, like, just like my sister, uh, I was SMSing my sister. And she was like, how are you doing today? I was not so good. How about you? No, I'm working from home because I feel a little sick. And I was like, yeah, me too. I feel like stuffy in the nose and stuff. So if I have COVID, I don't fucking know. And stupid uh, Donald Trump isn't doing it better. <laughs> don't be afraid of COVID. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and you know, a Karen, I was going to say mukbang, but I ain't eating anything. Wouldn't be anything without a frappe caramel. They are so delicious. Have you all tried them? Leave it in the comments below. But they made them kind of... Uh, they thought they were going to make them taste better or something. But they added Oreo cookies. And I've never liked Oreos. In Sweden, for some reason, think I think they think... <laughs> I think they think that Americans love Oreos. Like, that's the only cookie there is. Or not the only one, of course, but the most popular one. But I don't think so, because when I lived there, we never bought Oreos. We bought other cookies and stuff, so... I don't know where they came from, you know, this Oreo craze in Sweden. It's like, Oreo this, Oreo this, that's American. But last time, well, yesterday, I went to the store and they have like a uh, American aisle. Well, not the whole aisle, of course. So I bought pancakes and syrup. So I'm going to surprise my sons maybe on Sunday, just like we used to do in Georgia. When my mom was alive and stuff, you know, it was so, <laughs> like, no, well, mostly we would eat uh, eggs and bacon and uh, sausage, but we often went out to restaurants to, you know, we had really fun when lived there, so, well, what am I going to say now I can uh, maybe say something interesting. This guy, Jan Glue. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be copyrighted. Well, I don't give a shit. Well, anyways, he's a famous author. <laughs> and that's called Unskan, I guess, evil or what the fuck. 
But an interesting fact is that my dad went the same went to the same school as he did. But not at the same time, of course. See, y'all can hear that my nose is like Do you like my necklace, by the way? I love it. <laughs> okay, now we can show what I was thinking about, obviously. Well, I'm wearing some of this sh the socks I was going to show, but I don't... Look at these socks. They're so pretty. I love glittery things. And then I bought... Oh, this very... So cute sweater. When I saw it, I was gonna shit. <laughs> I was thinking that one I have to buy. I don't know if y'all can see this, but look, isn't it so cute? It's a large, but I pro I don't know if I'll fit in it just right now. But um working on it like i said i love it so i couldn't not buy it and by the way you know about going about losing weight i don't know if you i don't know in other countries there might be a program called the biggest loser but there is one in sweden that's called the biggest loser and uh, fat people come in <laughs> me Fat people come in and they, uh, you know, compete and stuff like that just to lose weight. They learn to eat right. They exercise. They, yeah, do like everything. I I, I watched the first uh, uh, part yesterday, but I was thinking about it before I watched it yesterday. But now I really think. Like, next, the next season, I'm going to, like, maybe apply. But luckily, I don't weigh as much as they did. Like, because if if I weighed that much, I would be so, so devastated, you know. It's not, I mean, uh, like, you know, Tess Holiday. She, she is beautiful. But, I mean, look at her body her body she is like you know i'm fat but tess holiday is like i don't know she probably wouldn't even fit the frame and she was the one who started uh, i think the what's it called uh like f your beauty standards yeah that's true but i mean and I'll, i'm all for plus size models of course but she is maybe a, a tad bit, it's unhealthy. And she, she says that she is fine and everything. But I don't see how she can be. Because when I walk up the stairs and everything, I think it's hard. But I don't know. So I don't know what I think about that. On to the next. This one reminds me of in Sweden. Anyways, how am I going to explain this? <laughs> They have, like, ovens that's called Kakelugna. So, this reminded me of that. See, I love this combination. I love, like, white and, you know, nice blue. And this one I bought also. It's an XL, yeah. And my feet already hurt. It's cute, right? <laughs> Fuck, why do my... I'm sorry, but it hurts. I'm trying to, you know... And the rest of the bras, I think. I don't think they're interested in that. Maybe the women are. Not that any... I don't know. But if you live in Sweden and... <coughs> you go to Kapol... These bras that have, they're seamless. They are the most comfortable bras I've ever worn. I'm sorry, my legs are hurting like fuck. <sighs> I should have taken out a uh, headache pill. But for you, all you ladies out there, 
you should buy one from um, Catball because you know you see there's no it's not hard or anything it's so comfortable like it's taken me this long to find the perfect bra so I bought one two wait yeah two so then yeah three four I bought tons of them. <laughs> oh yeah okay we'll put the bras aside because I bought some jewelry too but that's not the bag I was looking for excuse me I'm a little bit no it's not <laughs> what the fuck there I was just gonna get these out of the way because I don't want them on the floor because my cats do all kinds of stuff on the floor I mean not dirty stuff <laughs> Well, of course, well, never mind. Yeah, and I showed those, right? Yeah. So now I was gonna... Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, you know, I hate, like... You know, I grew up in America, and... Some people might say that um, they don't have a good health care or anything. But if you have money, they can help you. And I would have, and they would help me. But it hurts like fuck because I've, it's, I've rang twice to the stupid, uh, not hospital, but uh, I don't know what's it called in English. And I said... It really, really hurts. I mean, it, even if they can't do anything right now, why can't they write out a prescription for painkillers? You know, it's not fair that you're supposed to go around. It hurts like fuck. It feels like, you know, I just want to... I don't know. And then I bought, I think I might have bought this. Oh. I think, I think I already bought this one. I don't remember, but I thought it was so cute. <laughs> so I was thinking I was going to have some, you know, for my pennies and stuff. Quarters and pennies and flunur in there. And then I bought... Now they don't look that pretty. They look pretty in the store. <laughs> well, that was strange. And these are similar to the ones I'm wearing right now. <laughs> and then I bought a whole lot of jewelry. Like, you know, if I was a millionaire, boy, would I be... Spending like shit. Sorry, I got the hiccups. Oh, these are so pretty. Oh, I love them. Pretty, right? And this is for the hair. Bling, bling. When I bought all this stuff, the lady said, uh, yeah, you're ready for some bling. Oh, this one I love. It's like a double uh, a thing. <laughs> What's it called in English? And this perfect for Christmas. Oh, but speaking of holidays, uh, have y'all already thinking about what you're gonna do on Halloween? Even though we moved to Sweden from America. We like to celebrate Halloween anyways, especially my sister. <laughs> she just sent me like a photo of her pump, no, like evil pumpkins and stuff like that. <laughs> and her daughter, and a scrunchie, uh, is turning four. So she also loves uh, Halloween because I guess they scared her enough. I don't know. 
Oh, this one was really cool. I didn't know it was like that. <laughs> See, I buy stuff without thinking about it. And the last thing. Oh, yeah, these were the snakes. Those are like... So, if you live in Sweden, Kapol is from... And I would recommend to buy stuff not from Glitte, which is another store in Sweden. Because I spent like almost <laughs> half an hour just trying them on. Like, they'd pop off and everything, you know. So, Sweden is... I mean... Uh, glitter is not a good place to buy stuff, but it's cheap, so I get it why people buy stuff, you know. But the more it costs, it's better, of course. <sighs> there was something else, though. Well, I do have other things to show, but <sighs> the stupid thing now I'm stuck. Oh, yes. No. <laughs> now I'm stuck between tons of stuff. I don't even know what I've shown. My glasses I was going to show up. I don't remember. And I, I kept, like I said, I think I said uh, in my last video. Not my last video. But the video before that, like, I kept a few books. That really mean a lot. To <laughs> excuse me, I'm just gonna change position. I think if, it... if I can, I'm just gonna. <laughs> the, wonders. <laughs> the wonders of uh, what the fuck is it called? Now I look like something else. I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> no, but I think this dress is is pretty. But now I look pretty weird, right? I don't know. I don't know what the fuck. Oh, oh, okay, yeah. My, you know, when I bought these glasses. Hold on a minute. I'm going to just go to take uh, two headache pills because this is not normal. <laughs> what do you think? Think about how you're going to survive and everything. Sorry, excuse me. Bitch has fun watching the video. <laughs> oh, yeah, you, you see. Cha 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 cha. <laughs> no, but seriously. Ugh. No, I showed you guys my... I have not a good setup because it, like, fucking hurts. I swear I don't have any... Well, I do have pillows and stuff like that. 
Wait, I'm gonna... Shit. I love pillows. I have tons of them. Maybe I'm like a collector. I don't know if you've seen this one. Jaws. Unicorn. And this one is very special. Because I made it. I made it myself. With a person that I love. Which one? Well... You guys should not say that, but it's the truth. Okay, let's continue. <sighs> oh, shit. No, when I, I don't remember when I bought these glasses. They had a great deal. They had like uh, three, no, oh, you could buy three. And have like um, not anything for free. I don't remember what it was like, you know. But anyways, <laughs> it was you could buy three, and um, wait, was it three? No, it didn't be three. Wait, now I'm confused. Oh, okay. Oh no, yeah. You could buy three uh, for this and this uh, number of money. <laughs> Not number of money. <laughs> the price, yes. How long have I been talking? I bet you all guys are so bored. <laughs> if you're still listening, I don't even know what your life must be. <laughs> no, I'm joking. But anyways, but I couldn't decide... So there was this guy that worked there and he said, these you absolutely must get. So these are the ones I've been wearing all the time. I haven't even tried the other ones, you know, to go out or anything because uh, my sister told me these were better because she saw photos and stuff of this. Um, but I think I really want to start using the other ones too because you know, like I said, uh, I, it was supposed to be three, but there was one I really, really loved. And the guy there was like, mm, you know, not so good. But I don't care because I'm funny and strange and whatever, you know. So I like to, well, I don't know. It's funny because I'm an introvert person. But at the same time, when, like, I go someplace special or whatever, like, to my sister's for, hol uh, like, birthdays or whatever, I like to dress, you know, really platy and makeup and stuff like that. So, I really like weird things, you know? So, I think that's why the guy said, no, it doesn't fit you. But <laughs> he doesn't even know me, so what the fuck? So, we're going to try. Oh, we'll leave the Michael Kors. My, um, the fourth pair are upstairs. Because those are reading glasses. So, you're supposed to get two or original glasses and one reading glasses. But I couldn't help it. And this is from Burberry. No, how do you say it? Burberry. <laughs> Burberry. Oh, I didn't think about that. I don't know. This might be even better than Michael Kors. Because it, the weird thing is, I've seen Michael Kors clothes. It sounded like I said Michael Kors. <laughs> Michael Kors clothes. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> and I... I'm very interested in fashion, but I never liked his, like, clothes or anything. So, I was surprised that I liked his glasses. <laughs> well, he might be a hoe. Oh, it was a long time I took these out, actually. These are really pretty. From Burberry. No, how do you pronounce it? Burberry? 
shit. Yeah, you can tell I have a name. Shit, I think they... Oh. Yes. Oh, why am I going around with those boring things when I can wear this? <laughs> yeah, but these are so pretty. I need to stop. I mean, I need to start changing glasses. Oh. If you guys think this is crazy, then you're in for a ride. <laughs> for Michael, of course. No, I don't think. I don't think they're weird or anything, but other people might. And I love the cases, you know. Of all the things I buy, actually, the only thing... I have to put this so I don't smash them. The only thing I um, invest in... Well, not invest. That's the wrong word. In designer stuff, of course, is glasses. Because glasses are important, so you can't buy cheap shit. Because, one, they're not going to help, and two, you know... That's the only thing. But if I had money, you know, it would be a totally different story. These were... <laughs> Even I think they're kind of too flashy. But for some reason, I couldn't resist them. I think they're so... They're so... I don't care if they, they don't fit my face or anything. Look. So cool. Can you see? They're so cool. I don't even fit. I don't think I fit in them. <laughs> See? <laughs> I just thought they were so cool. I could not buy them, you know? If you got the... Cash. But these seem like I don't see very well with them. Oh, yeah, dude. It's like... I can't... It's like... Um, if you look, well, I don't know. <laughs> These I'm going to wear next time I go to a party and people are going to like, what's that? Michael Kors, baby. <laughs> no, I wish I was like so fucking rich. I would buy fucking every, the whole world. <laughs> because I'm a shop shopaholic. And the guy was so sweet, he gave me some stuff. I don't even know what it is. Maybe it's something to clean the glasses or something. And now back to my um, Harry Potter glasses. And a little genre. So. Yeah. And um, I can't wait till I show you guys, like, um,. The rest of my room, what I've been thinking about doing and stuff. Because I got inspiration from... Wait. Uh, I got inspiration... I'm trying to grab this without spilling everything. From another person, how to um, uh, make my room nice. You know... <laughs> I know I'm overweight and stuff like that, but this dress makes me look like, hello. I don't know why, but I'm not as fat as I look like, but <laughs> not, that it, <laughs> not that it matters. I mean, I don't care really what people think because... It's only that... I, it's on the inside that matters. No, but doesn't it suck? Like in your country, do you have good health care and stuff like that? Here is so. And then if you if you write it on Facebook, if you write like, "Oh, Swedish health care sucks," blah, blah blah, then you get attacked, and they like say, "No, no, it's so great, great bullshit." My dad, he's uh, married to an Indonesian lady. Do you know? 
well, <laughs> now I shot myself in the foot or oh, whatever you're supposed to say. I was going to say he does his uh, doctor's appointments in Singapore. Well, some he does, but other stuff he does is a private hospital in Sweden called, um, I just had it on my tongue. Uh, well, fuck what it's called. But it's <laughs> I'm so stupid. So <laughs> Sophia Hemet, I think that's called. Yeah, that is probably the only place. Uh, speaking of which, you know, uh, like 2000 and when was it? 2012, I think. For Christmas, I asked my dad, I wrote down, you know, what I wanted for Christmas, you know, like you do. And I wanted to do a boob job. <laughs> Lift and make them bigger, you know. And he gave it to me, you know, but it never happened. So, but the funny thing is when, when I opened, like, the envelope, there was a picture of this girl with big boobs and stuff like that. And we drove up to Stockholm to this Sophia Hemet. And I go in the room. You know what the stupid doctor said? Well, he wasn't stupid. But do you know what he said? He, I have a scar here. Because I fell on the pavement for uh, several years ago. The first, that's what he said. He said, oh, you have a scar on your lip. Like, yeah, I know. That's not why I'm here. <laughs> so, I don't know. <sighs> God. You guys are so lucky that I don't have a back pain. I swear. I think. Yeah, and plus, you know, I've been having this fan going all summer. But this summer, it, it hasn't been that hot. But I've always liked. Uh, the sound of a fan. <laughs> that sounds weird, but when I lived in the U.S., it was obvious we had to use one. <laughs> but I've uh, and my mom, she, uh, I drove her crazy. <laughs> I always put it on when the air conditioning was on, anyways. So, <laughs> oh, and it sounds strange now because it's collected dust and everything. So I swear it sounds like it's people whispering and it's scary like i'm lying in bed and i hear that it's like is somebody whispering it's all it is doing it now so it's like i think somebody is talking to me in my sleep oh and it's so scary like shit maybe it is something you know that we don't know of you know? It sounds like, like last night, I think it was, yeah. It sounded like a boy who was saying, help me, help me. And, oh, now I'm getting scared. Shit. Now it was quiet because I said that. No, but but isn't that strange if a fan has dirt on it and stuff that it sounds like a person whispering, you know, like evil stuff? Okay, I think I've talked too much. I'm just going to show you one last thing. I bought a raincoat, but I don't know if it... But this was, uh, like, on sale or something. Oh, I love this material. Well, it's... Can't find the... Yeah, the darn thing. I can't find the thing. Okay. Well, it's hard to show. <laughs> But it was very cheap. So, and it's got, can't see, it's like a little like 
leopard prints. And then, you know, I love army style stuff, so I bought this for no reason. It's just that I love army stuff for some reason, like I said. <laughs> and I couldn't pass up on this either. First I went, I went past this and I said, no, what's that? But then I saw this glitter and then I bought a black one I'm just gonna show you oh, fuck. and a black one right now I'm gonna go fucking fuck my back <laughs> you know I'm trying to find a better place that I can Or better, yeah. No, but I'm. I know I'm gonna make videos in here and stuff like that. But I just want to. I don't want to sit on the fucking floor because it hurts like fuck. Even if I, I don't know. It probably would hurt still if I didn't have back problems. Because you don't see many people sitting on the floor and just ooh, Mary Cherry. But, uh, uh, I just want to end it on one note. If you're ready to be depressed, <laughs> and you probably haven't even come this far, so it doesn't matter. But for me, it matters. But when I look down, this looks so cute with this pink shit and these shoes. <laughs> it looks cute. But that's not what I was going to do. No, it wasn't this one. Wait. What? I know I had it here. strange. <laughs> I feel like my, um, I have a cat that has three legs. I feel like her right now because now I think oh, before I I'm all over the place. Before I say the thing I was going to say, I just remembered that I was going to review this. Trocadera, it's called. And people in Sweden like this. And I've tasted it like a couple of times. And I, and I think it's like, gr and not gross, but it doesn't taste good. And then, oh, I wanted to just. So I'm going to test it now and see if it tastes good. I don't, well, uh, I don't know. <laughs> no, on a sad note, I'm going to end this for my mom's sake. Like I told you in my previous videos, my mom loved to read and everything. <laughs> She would sit in a plum or apple tree and read when she was like 15, 12, 12 to 15, or even older, while other people are doing other stupid stuff. But she was just reading. And in, in the old days, they wrote down, like, to this person. I think I already said this, I don't know. But anyways, this says, um, my mom was named Silvia. And says to Sylvia on her 50, 
15 a year day. She was only 15 when she got this. So this one I'm very, I'm, I'm keeping for sure. Because she was so happy probably when she got it because that's all she wanted when she like was celebrating the books. Yeah, I shouldn't have brought that up <laughs> because now I don't feel very good. So, well, I haven't felt good for so many. Well, now it's like almost a year since she died. Well, anyways, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed my weird haul or whatever it was. <laughs> Which probably is going to take like fucking four hours to upload. Because I don't know what you guys are doing to upload your videos. Because my videos take fucking forever. And I think I do it on the phone, right? So every time it starts to go black, I, I push the thing. Because otherwise I think it stops. Or am I wrong? Does it continue? Even though if I let it go dark? Leave it in the comments below. Because actually I don't know. <laughs> I'm so bad at this stuff. <laughs> I used to have a friend that could help me edit and everything. But he's... I don't know. <laughs> he's... Found green pastures. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for the... Uh, fucking depressing ending. But hopefully next time I'll show you guys more of my room. Because I love the way it looks. You know, pink and everything. And... Weird stuff, glitter, shit, all over the place. <laughs> if I, uh, well, I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> okay, take care now. Bye.